Well, UNESCO has been promoting the concept of knowledge societies uh, based on a certain number of uh, concepts and principles, which are uh, diversity, uh, equity in education, uh, freedom of expression. So, uh, and for this reason, uh, since the beginning of the World Summit on Information Society, uh, UNESCO has been an active uh, player in this uh, environment. And as a matter of fact, UNESCO is a uh, UN agency who facilitates some action lines in the uh, plan of action of the World Summit on the Information Society. But my specific presence here is due to the fact that I am dealing with the promotion of multilingualism in the digital world. And uh, as part of this uh, work, UNESCO has been uh, preparing some publications, promoting uh, debate, dialogue among the different uh, stakeholders. And uh, in this specific forum, we are organizing a workshop this afternoon on uh, the topic of multilingual global internet, avoiding the risk of fragmentation. And this explains why I'm here. <laughs>
perspectives on the multilingual internet. And uh, today we are also discussing the more specific topic of avoiding uh, fragmentation. Uh, of course, uh, during this uh, forum, it, it is already said by the people that was in the beginning of internet, like Mr. Vinton Cerf and uh, Mr. Robert Kahn, that today internet is different from its beginning. Uh, so uh, there are uh, 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 important new issues for uh, debate. And that's why we are here in the Internet Governance Forum. Well, uh, if I put it as a utopia, I would say that utopia in the area of multilingualism is that as many uh, languages as possible be present in the Internet. And this is utopian also is related to the utopian of the multilingualism, because as it's, it's uh, expected that as people speak as many languages as possible. Of course, this is a, a sort of a vision for the, the topic. And I think that this vision also applies to the Internet. Well, uh, you know that um, uh, due to the, let's say, a vulnerability of uh, technology, uh, uh, here and there you see the misuse of technology. Uh, we privilege mainly the use of technologies for education, science and culture, because this is the focus of UNESCO's organization in the area of uh, also communication and information. But um, we believe that uh, through a participatory debate, it will be possible to prevent uh, from this misuse, meaning by that uh, pornography, uh, um, the use of uh, information and communication technologies for uh, racism for segregation, these are the dangers. And of course, uh, we also believe that as the way to address these risks is a participatory process. And uh, we are very happy in seeing the Internet Governance Forum because it, ha it is a good platform to uh, discuss the different views and we believe that uh, by this debate it will be focused on preventing the uh, misuse and these uh, risks, which are, by the way, not uh, um, created by internet, but are more or less a sort of projection of the social uh, uh, problems onto a technological uh, tool. Participation in education. Mm. Great. <laughs> Thank you so much. Okay.